Growing up, I saw original influencers always dolled up every time you see them on camera. Nowadays, we tend to prefer authenticity above all else, which means it's common to see new waves of influencers simply barefaced and telling stories in front of their phone. Because I grew up with the first type of media, I often felt like I had to put on makeup before I left the house or else I wasn't ready or pretty enough. The irony of it all was that I couldn't bear to be barefaced around people in real life, so I preferred to be barefaced online to millions of strangers instead. Because I wanted the world to see how I could transform this bareface into a work of art, I needed to accept and love the blank canvas it started with. How could I expect the world to appreciate my art if I didn't appreciate the foundation? I use makeup in a way that makes me examine my facial features really closely. It means I had to get to know my bone structure, my skin and my fine lines and use them to my advantage. There was a time where I'd fight against them, but really I was fighting against my own idea of what beauty looked like. So in my artistic pursuit with makeup, I intentionally created things that aren't meant to be conventionally beautiful. And strangely from this experience, I found myself truly loving my face for the very first time.